Happy Boxing Day, Happy Stocking Stuffer Edition. Welcome back, everybody. This is Swansea Beat. My name is Dustin Rubio. And I'm Alex Thomas. And please do follow us on Twitter at Swansea Beat. Like us on Facebook at Swansea Beat. At Swansea Beat. Share, um, tell your friends, your nan, whoever. Just spread the love of swans. Um, yeah, subscribe on YouTube as well. But now let's get to business Alejandro a Alex. Special edition. Special edition. And we are calling this the stocking stuffer. And this is how it's going to go. Okay. Right? So we are either going to give, let's just say that players okay. within the swans have a stocking. The current squad. Yeah. Okay. And we are either going to put in a gift. Okay. If they're deserving of it. Or okay. we're going to put in a lump of coal. Okay. If they are deserving of that just All right. terrible gift of a lump of coal. Does that make sense? Yep. Okay. So right. you're basically saying who's terrible and who's bad. Right? Pretty much. And it's just a more festive way. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Yeah. 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 Like yeah. Like yeah, yeah. Like okay. So start thong off players and we'll just start dishing out. Do you want to go in order or should I just name a random player? Sure, just go maybe start from, uh, start from whatever. Start from positions. Defense. Okay. Norton. Oh, I would say I'd give him a, a lump of coal. I think he's been inconsistent. Yep. And I think, well, I know when we played against Man City, there was a, a, a little part. I might have showed you. I think I did a video of it on my TV. And he just completely let them all pass by him. And once David Silva scored, he just kind of went down and, yeah. and just started messing with his shoe. And I'm thinking, dude, at least get mad. Don't just be like, oh, let me fix my shoe. So... Two lump of coals for that dude. Okay, same here for me. Terrible all mm. season. Mm. Uh, he's had maybe two good performances and that's it. Yeah. Not worthy of even getting a present. Hope he has yeah. a terrible Christmas. Okay. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, lump of coal for Carl yeah, yeah. Okay. All right, Martin Olsen. I would say I'll give him a gift. I'll give him a good gift. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I think he's been good. I think, uh, yeah, he got a goal this season, right? Did he get a goal this season? Yeah, well, yeah, no, I think it's an assist he's got. He's got an assist, yeah. That's right. He had two goals last season. Yeah. Um, but yeah, no, I think I think he's good. Um, yeah, I give okay. him a gift. Yeah, uh, same year. I think he's one of. Well, he was our best signing last January. Yeah. And even going into this season, he's been okay, been consistent. Not a lot of mistakes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I think. Same. Okay, I don't want to name both centre backs. Okay, let me just name a partnership instead. Okay, because yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like if we name them individually, it'd be a bit weird. Yeah. yeah so yeah. the partnership of Fernandez and Molson. Right. I would have said, up until after Tottenham, I would have said many gifts. Yeah. Because in the beginning we were like, man, they're they're great. This is yeah. our strength. But I don't know what the heck happened. But it, it's going to have to be Cole. Because I'm thinking of right now in this in this time now. Yeah. I would say I'd give them Cole. But I think I think somewhere in there there's potential for them to get gifts. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So I'm going to same here for me. A bit of Cole. Start off well. Gone downhill ever since then. Mm. Next person. I think I'll go first for this one. Yeah. Mike Vanderhorn. Right. Lately presence all around for him yeah, yeah. I feel like he's been deserving of a start and obviously Fernandes came back in hasn't mm. got the start since yeah, yeah, yeah I feel like he deserves a gift to use our best defender to be honest yeah At the, you know in the Tottenham game he played I believe he did he play as Tottenham or was it Bartley no it wasn't Bartley it was Van der Horn then yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, th I feel like he did well yeah, you know, yeah, I feel yeah. it was either one or two I couldn't figure out but yeah you know that he did well and I feel like he deserves more starts so a nice yeah. present for Van der Yeah, I'll give him a present as well. Yeah. yeah. Nothing, I think if they don't make crazy mistakes and stuff, yeah. um, then I'll just mm. like it. I feel like this one's going to be a controversial one. Rocky Messer. Um, I'll give him a gift. Yeah, I mean, I think, yeah. He, he hasn't had a lot of starts. And, yeah. you know, there are different rumors for different reasons why or whatever. I mean, that look, it, it doesn't matter. Mm. You know, like, to me, I think... It's just, we're not talking about their lifestyle, we're talking about performances on the pitch. And I think when he's on there, for the most part, you know, I think he could even be better if he had more playing time, yeah. you know? But um, I'd give him a gift. Yeah, uh, same here. I'm, I'm a big fan of Messer. I'm gutted, it's only only taken the last about five games for him to actually have consistent starts. Yeah. It's a bit of a gutter, but yeah, a big fat present for Messer. Mm. Tom Carroll. I 
like Tom Carroll, but I'd say right now it'd have to be a Cole. Yeah? Yeah, but I do like him. Last season, I would have said yeah. gifts all around. Uh, yeah, last season he was great when he came in, but now I think he just hit form. But that's the whole side in general. Yeah, it, it, and yeah. I, was, I was just going to yeah. say that. I would say it, it could be possibly just because it's a team sport. Yeah. And, you know, yeah. it's just the way it works. Sometimes the other team can just pull you down. Next one. Lucas Fabianski. Oh, gifts all around for his yeah. family, everybody. Yeah. Everybody knows his neighbor. Our best player. Yeah. Honestly. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Such a good player. Yeah. Same, you know, you can't really say much more than that. Fantastic goalkeeper. Yeah. Wilfred Bonny. Um, this is a, a tougher one for me than Messa. Because um, I think he is trying, mm. but that doesn't, you know, yeah. it, it doesn't get results it doesn't get you goals you know I think he, we just want him to yeah to get some results and some and perform um I would say Cole Cole not based on his just the way the whole thing is panned out yeah, yeah. yeah because I was I was pretty hyped up I mean the song was great it was trending huh. you know when we got him and I think just the way the whole mm-hmm. thing has worked out was like you barely played and I know you got a couple goals but you're yeah. injured again and it's just like I'm going to give him some presents mm. because I feel like even though we didn't go off to start because of fitness and this other stuff, but ever since he's given, given that captain's armband, mm. he was great. Like, if he wasn't screwed out of a goal against Bournemouth, he would have had three and three. Mm. And hopefully this injury doesn't cost him too much. But I, yeah. feel, I feel like, you know, if the injury isn't too bad, which is only a hamstring strain, but you never know how yeah. that fluctuates with players. Yeah. So I, I would like to give him some presents. Tammy Abraham. I would say uh, I'd give him a present. Yeah. I think he tries hard. I mean, he's young. Look, you know, he, he's still growing. Yeah. You know? <laughs> he's still growing into his body. And, and um, you know, he, he works hard. I'll yeah. give him that. And, look, he managed to get some goals. He's our top know? scorer. Yeah, he managed to get some goals. And With look, a mighty four goals. Yeah, for real. So, yeah, I'll give him. I'll, I'll say gifts for him. Yeah, gift. I think. You know he's on loan to us, and he's probably one of the most passionate players at the moment. Mm. You know he's, uh, you know I think in some of the games you can just tell how disappointed he was. Like you know he even knows in the back of his mind like next season I'm back at Chelsea. Like, mm. You know, champion, yeah, yeah. You know maybe I can break into a Champions League squad one day, but yet he's still like no no, no I'm at Swansea I'm gonna work for the team yeah. I'm gonna do my best I, and he, his work ethic is stupid like it's mm. really good yeah no, no. and has a lot of strength and he has some good pace on him. I, you know, I, I'm hoping he can score more goals with a new manager coming in. I'm, mm. I'm looking forward to seeing what Tammy can bring. But yeah, a, a lot of presents for me. Yeah, yeah. Narsing. Man, this is a tough one too. I feel like we should have used him a lot more. Yeah. And I think when he's on, I think that I feel like there's always a potential threat. Mm. I'm not saying he's like, you know, old school bail, you know, coming yeah, on the right, yeah. cutting into the left and get a go you know, but I I feel like with his pace, you know, um I'd give him a present. Yeah. Yeah. I, I feel the same way. I think if he was played more often I think we would have had maybe even better results coming yeah. in. It's same as Meso. It's the same it's the thing where it's like <laughs> give him a gift and it's not his fault he hasn't played him for whatever reason, but I yeah. Yeah. Jordan are you? Um I would say overall it's it's difficult because I think if we're going off of like goals and stuff like that then obviously it'd be a well yeah up he's a got goal. he's got zero goals zero assists yeah well yeah. he's no he's got a goal Remember oh he's got one, one goal yeah, yeah, yeah he's yeah. got that one goal that kind of whatever his shoelace ran into and <laughs> just so happened to go over no but but I like him I think he works hard yeah you know what I'm saying so that part of him he works hard he seems like he cares yeah. you know he wear, he seems like the type of dude who wears motion on the sleeve. And, and, you know, some players seem like they can care less if we lose, you yeah. know, like, but for him, he seems bothered. Um, so I think with his attitude, I think with his work ethic, I'd give him, I'd give him a gift, barely, but I think with the goal thing, I'd be like, uh, maybe a lump of coal, I feel torn on that. Okay. Yeah, I think, whew, I'd say presents. Yeah, I'd probably say presents for him. No particular reason, I just think he could do better, but I feel like... Yeah, I don't know. It's such a hard one, actually, because mm. when you look at stats, you're like, oh, lump of coal. But when you look at a work ethic, you're just like, oh, man, he tries too hard. He's so passionate. You know, he, he seems passionate about the team. Yeah. 
But I think I'm going to go on a stats thing here and maybe say Cole. Yeah. It, it is hard because if you look at it as in like position, you yeah. would say, oh, yeah, 100%. You know, mm. Cole. But when you're looking at it, the whole team, you're thinking, who in our team looks like they care and they give given 100% every yeah. game? Then you would have to say he, he's yeah, up there, yeah. you know, um, same as Abraham and, and you know, Fabianski and some of these other ones, but he would be up there. Yeah. So in that part, you know, if you're looking at the squad with no yeah. positions, just players that, that you know, yeah. working hard, trying, care, all that stuff, passion, I'd say him. But if it's on position and stats, yeah. then yeah. Sam Klukas. Oh, cool. Yeah. <laughs> no, I don't know if I say anything Yeah, Sam Klukas, Cole. Cole. Leroy Fur. Mm. If I had to say one, Cole. Mm. Even though he's hit a goal against Everton, but I think yeah. that was pure luck more yeah. than anything. Like, it was just spur of the moment. Just yeah. got a lucky header. But, yeah. I'd go Cole as well. Yeah, Cole. Yeah. I like him, but yeah, I'd say Cole. And one I think needs presence for me. Sung Young Ki. I mm-hmm. feel like he's a good player. I'm yeah. glad he had some starts uh, a couple of games ago. I don't know what's going on with him now. Maybe he'll yeah. get some more games. Maybe hopefully against Palace. But yeah, I- I'd say get, I think mm. some presence for Key. Yeah. Would you agree? Okay. Um, or are you not sure? Yeah, I mean, he, look, he hasn't played much. And I think since he came back, you know, yeah, he, look, he yeah. looks, you know... I think I would say similar things that I said about IU. I think he, mm. you know, he seemed like he's trying. He's trying to win his place back. Yeah. You know, which is great. You know, and and he probably could win his place back because mm. midfield wise, we're not really doing great. You know, yeah. and Sanchez, you know, we haven't got to him at all. But you know, uh, I think I most people I would say Cole. Yeah, him. I know for real. <laughs> Seriously, I forgot about him until I just started thinking of midfielders that yeah. he could take his place back again. Yeah. So I'm thinking, oh yeah, this guy. Renato. I feel I feel bad for him. I will say that. Yeah, I do feel bad for him. Um, because I, you know, I can imagine being from a different country coming yeah. here and, and trying to adjust and stuff. But at the same time, you think you're a professional, you should mm-hmm. be, but he's young, you know, coming in and it's a different style. He's mm-hmm. not used to playing with this sort of caliber mm-hmm. of players, you know, let's be honest. Yeah. I think he realized the hype was around him and maybe got a bit nervous around yeah. him as well. Some people so. don't handle well with pressure. Um, but look, if we're going off performance and, yeah, and stuff like that, cold. I mean, it's cold. It is, you know, yeah. I'd love to give him, pre- I'd love to give the whole team presence, but look, it's not. You know, it's cold. Being realistic, isn't yeah. it? So, yeah. But what about can, what about what about the what about the behind the scenes? What about the board? <laughs> Cole, man, Cole. Cole. I recently with Clement sacked. Uh, maybe give him a pen or something. <laughs> Just like not a giant present. Um, yeah, it's been a very very bad year for the board. Well, it's been bad for a couple of years now, but especially yeah. this year, it's been highlighted. Yeah. Um, yeah, the board just give them some coal, man. Throw them at their windows. You know? mm. <laughs> don't, don't do that. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I hope Hugh has a terrible Christmas and leaves. Oh, he did because Christmas was yesterday. Oh yeah, I, I'm sorry. Keep you on your toes. <laughs> um, yeah, no, I agree. Coal. I think it's just something needs to. Yeah. You know, something just needs some change or something like that. But yeah. one more player, Leon Britton. Oh. Britain, I would say, I would say presence, but I would say the gift is based on more of uh, attitude and passion yeah. and those things. Because yeah. he hasn't played enough, let's be honest. He ain't played enough to be on But I know when he does play, yeah. you know, he is going to give his all, you yeah. know. And, and because of his position, he doesn't have to score. He just needs to be able to keep the ball, win the ball, you know. Yeah, 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 um, yeah, yeah. You know, stuff like that, but... Um, I think his role off the pitch. Yeah. For me, I would say you know, Giff. You know, he's cool. I like him. But yeah. Yeah. Awesome. That's it. Yep. Yeah. So if you disagree or you agree or something like that, you can have your voice. You can leave a comment and say, "Hey, look, I think Sanchez deserves gifts." And then we will say, "What the heck? What's wrong with you? You're crazy." Um, but anyways, yeah. So uh, hope you've had a good Christmas. Hope you're enjoying Boxing Day, and uh, we'll put out a really good episode coming up about just recapping over the whole year of 2017 yeah. the best of uh just a side note we will not be putting up a livable preview due to well busy period it yeah. is christmas after yeah, all yeah. but let's hope for the three points against liverpool or even a point <laughs> let's hope yeah. for the best and let's hope we get a manager in yeah. by this today today boxing day yeah but yes thank yeah. you for watching and we'll see you on new year